some of the situations that we've experienced in buying used chillers, and we get offered chillers all the time. And one of the chillers that were, was offered to us about a month ago was only two years old and was taken off, supposedly taken off a um, building that was being demolished. And it was represented to us as um, brand, almost brand new, few few hundred hours on it. And it was all true. The only problem was it had been frozen, which means that the tubes inside have split, which allowed water to get into all the mechanical compressors. Basically a scrap chiller. That is the risk that people take buying a chiller that isn't proven. If somebody had bought that, not only would they be out the purchase price, they would be out the transportation costs, the crane costs picking it up, crane costs unloading it, building a pad, putting in the electrical, putting in the water, getting it all hooked up to find out that it actually doesn't work. What they're going to salvage from it is a couple thousand dollars in scrap. And the rest, they got to start over again. And the next chiller probably won't match up with the infrastructure that you created for it, the water and the pipes and the electrical. So you got to start over again. That's the risk you have of buying an unproven chiller.